Hi, Internet and Casey. This is Melly uh, with number 52 of 25 and 52. I can't believe this is the last video. I'm, I have a lot of feelings about this. <laughs> um, so we'll have to do another project at some point in the future, but not yet, because maybe not yet. <sighs> It's definitely been a year. Um, I remember the first few months I was like, yeah, that was a boring one. Mine's going to be super boring and nothing's going to change in my life. Nah, 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 nah. And then it was all of a sudden, no, no, things are going to mostly change after the series, but things are, things are changing, you know? It's, it's neat. And boring is really not bad. I like the most of the kind of boring that my life has been. Um, in the sense that boring means stable. Boring <laughs> means like I'm doing things I like and so due to that I don't have the desire to change them that much um, until I do and that's cool too. So that's just something I wanted to get out there to sort of bring this to a close. Uh, I also, as I mentioned in a previous video, put together a spreadsheet called The Relentless Passage of Time. Um, involving the Google Calendar and um, Facebook events that I was subscribed to or whatever, you know, that I went to for the last year and change. Um, I think I did it from the beginning of 2013, so I'm going to go to that and give you some highlights. So, like I said, my uh, Relentless Passage of Time spreadsheet starts in January 2013, uh, where... I was in Cleveland spending New Year's Eve with you, the first of the two New Year's Eves with you on the spreadsheet. Um, and then I came back like three weeks later. And then the week after that, there's my there's an entry on my calendar called Water Plant to and Try on Dresses at the Parents. So that's an entertaining combination of things. I don't know, I did stuff, I went to Next, which was fantastic, ate a lot of animals, um, and prior to that, Kyle and I went to the Field Museum and took pictures of most of the animals that we would be eating. I think we accidentally missed something or other, but we went through, like, the, you know, animals in the Midwest and the birds the exhibits and just intentionally ch 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 took pictures. Oh, man, I visited you in Cleveland again shortly after 25 and 52 started. Uh, man, I miss seeing you all the time. That was, that was pretty great. I did a lot of traveling in fancy restaurants. It's, it's pretty cool. There was that week I devoted so much time to an internet scavenger hunt. And, and then I took the GRE and lots of things kept happening. Oh my god. The relentless passage of time has been relentlessly continuing. I just, you know, it's, it's been quite a year. I look at this list of events and I'm, some of them are like, oh yeah, that's ancient history. And some of them are, oh man, that, that feels like it happened two weeks ago. And all of them happened at about the same time. So I don't really know how that works. Uh, maybe I should learn more about memory. <laughs> I just, you know, I scrolled through and then I'm at this January with the horrible snowstorm dropping you at the airport and then just a few lines later there's my visit to Seattle and then I chose to, to live there which is still like a crazy thing to me. I can just up and choose where I'm going to live. Like I don't, I don't know about that. Uh, <laughs> So that's, that's crazy and delightful. <sighs> this past week has been busy at work, but not horrible busy. Like, it's been very busy, but not super crazy stressful busy. Just, eh, I do what I can, whatever. And I don't know if that's because I'm just more able to let it run off my back since I will, you know, like, I'm working as much as I, you know, as hard as I can on this. Um, but I'm still leaving in a few months, regardless of whether there's stuff left over or not. So it'll be someone else's problem. Like, it's not the most mature way to look at it, I guess. But I've got to 
go. I have, I have moving to do. <laughs> it's crazy. Well, um, why is this blurred? There we go. Well, that's it, I guess. This is what I look like at 25. This is what I sound like at 25. Kind of like 24. Kind of like 26, so far at least. Birthday's just a day. And on that note, I'm gonna put this project to bed. Uh, <laughs> yeah. As always, I love you, like a lot, like a lot, a lot. And that's all. Bye.